Hi Troopers and welcome to today's video. We've got a special one for you today. It's a p -p 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 pick up a penguin. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, today we're going to be making our very own penguins. Not this cute little one, but the chocolate bar one. Yeah. And not that one. Not the evil one, no. which has got dairy in it, no. which has hurt cows and tortured them. No, no, no. This is dairy free. Yeah. Oh yeah, that beautiful, beautiful. Vegan. Yes. Yeah. Vegan. P -p -p Make up a penguin bar. So for this, you need just a couple of ingredients. The most important two are vegan bourbon biscuits, <laughs> which can be picked up. Most bourbon biscuits are vegan. I know in ASDA they have it on the label. Uh, some don't, but just double check the ingredients. Again. Dark chocolate, vegan of course, this one says it on the back. We usually buy own brand stuff, which is a little cheaper, they run out yesterday. Uh, it's always nice to actually see the word suitable for vegans on the back of the packet. So, biscuits and chocolate, two main ingredients. You're also gonna need this, baking paper, because otherwise it sticks. Trust me, we've made that mistake before. <laughs> then, yeah, if you're a real fan of penguins, You'll remember that they used to be orange flavoured, so just a bit of orange flavour in there, or mint, and of course there's the traditional plain one. But we're also going to have a little bit of an experiment. Mm. Yeah. Never seen a, a, a penguin bar this flavour before, but we're going to go with salted caramel. Salted Ooh. caramel penguin. <laughs> now that is the main ingredient Minus one. One ingredient you do need, you must have, if you are making a penguin bar, and that's a joke. I mean, come on, yeah? Flipping over the wrapper, and it always had a joke on the back. Do you remember that? I do. Used to love that, yeah? So, yeah? What do you call a one-eyed dinosaur? I don't know. What do you call a one-eyed dinosaur? The Afikisaurus! <laughs> don't worry, we've got plenty of those coming. Yeah. Right, so, first thing we need to do, we'll put the biscuits to one side. We'll take the flavourings, put them to one side. We'll take these bars. Uh, Mummy, if you could pass the servants the uh, application, the tools. So you get, you, you get a spoon, you get a whisk. <laughs> a whisk. A whisk. <laughs> use, the, use it backwards. Start it. Smash it. That's it. The chocolate bar, not the table. So I'm sure the chocolate's all nicely broken up. The next job is to get some boiling water on the pan. Um. Right, the first job you need to do is get some water boiling and then get a glass bowl on top of the pan and then you start adding your chocolate just like what the kids are doing here. Now, we're adding two of the bars right at the beginning because first of all, we can do the plain ones and then once we've done the plain ones, we can add some of our flavouring, probably the orange one first, and we can make the orange ones as well Come on, kids, get them all in there. Don't be scared. Just don't touch the bowl. You could, but that's how you don't touch the bowl, mate. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Owl goes. Owl goes who? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Woohoo! <-hoo. Hey. laughs> Axel, knock, knock. Who's there? Boo. Boo. Oh, boo dear, I'm sorry. It's only a joke. It's only a Back, please. Mm -hmm. a spoon, give it a little stir. Oh, wait a minute. Always make sure that your uh, your spoons and the utensils that you use are dry. Just a little bit of water will actually ruin your chocolate. So now, as you can see, our chocolate's melted. And now comes the fun part. You take your barb on. And like we said, this is so simple, but you'll be shocked. It tastes just like a penguin. And you simply just place it into your chocolate. And then you flip it over. Make sure it's completely covered in chocolate. Get it out and get it onto your baking paper. If you've got a good sized bowl, that means you can do a good couple at once. Make sure it's completely covered in chocolate. How nice does that look? Mm. Mm. That's yummy. Yummy. Yeah. Right, so we've done a few of the plain ones. They're over here. 
And now we're going to add some of that orange flavour. Yeah. So, now, some, on some channels and cooking channels, they're going to give you exact measurements. I'm just going to say guess. <laughs> Hope for the best. Like, the best. like a bit of flavouring, add the flavouring. Just give it, be generous. Give it a stirring. Are we going to stir it, buddy? Yeah. There you go, give it a good stir. Oh, lovely. Ooh, delicious. Now, Caprice. Uh -huh. You, you, do you want to add some flowers? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. How many should I add? Three. Okay. Place it in. One. Is that one? Two. And one more right there. Three. There we go. Now do you want to flip them over? Yeah. Be careful. It smells yeah. like orange. It does smell of orange. That's it. Well done. Now it smells like chocolate orange. <laughs> yeah. Now, we were in a live stream video the other day, uh, which I'm going to talk more about in a moment. But in that video, one of the questions that was asked was, what would you do if your child wanted a biscuit, for example, that wasn't vegan? And my, the, my reply, and the reason why we're filming this today, was if you can't find a vegan version, which you usually can, there's always a way of making the vegan virgin and that's exactly what we're doing here the vegan penguin biscuits so easy to make so fun to make and they're cheap as well I, I haven't been feeling well recently I went to the doctors I said doctor doctor I feel like a pair of curtains <laughs> he said pull yourself together man <laughs> so we've almost used all our biscuits now what's going to be the case she's going to come across broken ones now it's your choice you can either cover those in chocolate and having perfect penguin biscuits which just isn't right or you can do what these two are about to do and you get to eat them now mummy i've got a question for you go how do you know if will smith has been walking in the snow <laughs> i don't know it's the fresh prince <laughs> right guys so while we're just waiting for the, the chocolate to set um i'm going to talk very quickly about why we're doing this video um Sorry, <laughs> it smells so good in here in a moment. Oh, I can just smell orange chocolate, it's fantastic. I can't wait. But yeah, uh, as I mentioned earlier in the video, we was in a live stream, wasn't we? Yes, yeah. with the UK Vegan Family. And we're gonna put the link below. Mm -hmm. uh, please, please go check out that video. It will be coming up on our, our channel soon, but it's already up on their video. Um, please, please go follow them. They're a brilliant, lovely family yeah. who make some really, really good content. And you know those type of people where you can just almost feel the energy, even though you're not in the same room with them, yeah. uh, of just like this good, happy, loving family day, that type of people. So Definitely, 100% they are genuinely. Yeah. So go over to them, like, subscribe, share. It's so rewarding when you're a YouTuber and someone comes along and they like your video, they comment on your video, they share your video. It just gives you that little <laughs> feel good inside yeah. and they truly deserve it. They've also gone through uh, uh, some problems recently mm -hmm. where they've been trolled by some not very nice people, um, where they've mentioned about uh, body shaming basically and the child and it, it hasn't been pleasant, but they talk about that on the, uh, on the channel. And again, it's so important that all of, all of us vegans stick together, yeah. support each other, show love and support. So please head over to their channel. Watch the live stream as well. That was talking about vegan families. We talked about everything from schools to food, didn't we? And yeah. If, yeah, yeah, activism. Just life, yeah. Yeah, just, just life. life, really, yeah. Being yeah. life. Yeah. So like we said, go over, check them out. Check out the video. And... We'll be right back with some more penguins. So you should point out here that this is only half a bar. The other half a bar is going to be used for the salted caramel. Colin. Yeah? Why did the teddy bear not want dessert? I don't know. Why did the teddy bear not want dessert? Because he's already stuffed. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I should quite like that one. <laughs> Ooh, that's sweet. Salted caramel. Ooh, Ooh, look at the colour. Ooh. That's really strong. I want to ruin it. Oh, that smells amazing, actually. Yeah, just... Yeah, let's not ruin it. Oh, it's gone thick. Oh, oh it no. has, hasn't it? Oh, oh dear. Oh, no, the biscuit's in. Emergency. Oh. I got a bit uh, I saw, I saw, I saw the caramel's gone a bit wrong. Oh. Oh, no, it thickened it. 
Th th this is why we said not to get your chocolate oh. wet. And oh. Oh, what did it say on this? Wet water. Liquid. But oh, what a shame. Oh no. Oh no. Ruined. It's ruined. And oh, now. do you think? Because that's the flavour in these are extracts. Oh. So, Axel, what's your joke? Where did the cow? What? Where did the cow go on Friday night? I don't know. Where did the cow go on Friday night? To the movies. <laughs> <laughs> right. So we've just come back from a nice little walk down to the shops. Uh, nice to just get outside. It always important and let these set. Uh, so as you've literally just seen, it turns <laughs> out that uh, salted caramel flavored penguins. There's a reason they're not on the market. Yeah. yeah. Because they do not go good. No, it does not they work. They just go solid. Yeah. Yes. And they're well flavouring and not an extra. Yeah. So, yeah, so, so we that's think that's, we paid apart. We yeah. think that's the reason. But yeah. we, we yeah. make these mistakes so you don't have to. <laughs> yes. Anyway, it's the important time now. It's a great time. It's a brilliant time. Yay. It's the time we've been waiting for all day. Because mm. we get to sample these penguins biscuits. Hang on, I'll show you this one here. Bit of a close up, I'm quite pleased with the way these turn out. Which flavour are these, Mummy? Uh, orange. Orange? Mint. Mint. And plain. Plain. So grab one, kids. I'm grabbing plain. What? And bitey. Mmm, I like plain. What do you think, guys? Cold. 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 Ten out of ten? Yeah. So, guys, uh, as you notice, we put a few jokes in this video. Some pure quality stand up comedian style yeah. jokes there. Yeah. In, no che no she's in us from us but if you've got any jokes get them in the comments comment below give us your sheezy jokes yeah i want to hear them i want them to be funny if you do make these yeah instagram put them on instagram take pictures take, uh, put the recipe on instagram yeah and tag us in it that'd be fantastic and make them eat them enjoy them make them again and give them to friends yeah Let's show people how much fun and how delicious and how much your life just doesn't change when you are vegan. So until then, do something to put a smile on a friend's face. Make the world a slightly better place. Don't be an earth pooper. Be an earth